Soma from Malaysia. Uh, today I'm going to show you a test which I normally use uh, on people to show if there is energy in the water which they drink. So today I'm going to share with you how it's done. It works for me and I hope it works for you. Now this is a device I will be using. This is the iTeraCare blower device, iTeraCare Classic, which is uh, commonly used in household uh, for the whole family. Okay, we have five glasses here. You can see one is containing just plain water, all right, drinking water, plain drinking water. Second, we are going to test for 10 seconds using the iTeraCare. The third one, 20 seconds and the last one 30 seconds and we have one glass here uh, which has been uh, we have used a water device charged for three minutes and compare uh, with what we have done welcome mr pugalindran uh, mr pugalindran is going to help me with this test now this test is called a spleen test it's used uh, extensively in uh, traditional medicine, especially Indian traditional medicine and uh, it gives a good guideline, a subjective guideline as to content of energy in whatever that you are using. Okay, uh, first of all, uh, left hand, okay, put it on the left, around the area of the spleen, right hand, straight in front, okay, now I'm going to use my hand, straight hand, two fingers, okay, are you ready? I'm going to press it down and he's going to resist. Uh, I count three. One, two, three. So this is his strength, which means that I could still push it down, right? Easily push it down. Okay. So now we shall test some things, right? Thank you. This is for ten seconds of blowing using medium speed. This is for 20 seconds of rain. Yeah, this will be for 30 seconds of rain. Now we shall test with the five different uh, types of water. Three of them have, uh, we have used the blower for 10 seconds, 20, 10 seconds, 20 seconds and 30 seconds. Now this is basically plain water, drinking water. Uh, this is uh, filtered uh, drinking water without being charged. The last one is water which has been charged for three minutes using some other device. Uh, all right, which I, uh, also contains terahertz energy. All right, now we shall try it now. Mr. Uh, Pogolindran. Okay, now what you do is, you just hold this. First one is plain drinking water. I hold it here, the hands out. Okay, hold as strong as possible. Ready? One, two, three. So this is the energy contained in the normal drinking water. Now was it easy for me to push? Quite easy to push, right? Now this is the 10 seconds using the blower. Okay. Again. One, two, three. 
compared to the first one and the second one, which one is a bit harder? This one, eh? Okay, that means we have some energy there. Let's look at the 20 seconds. Okay. One, two, three. It's getting stronger now. Right? How do you find it? Compared to the first two, it's much higher. Alright. This is for 30 seconds. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah. It's good. Now, what can we say about the energy contained in this? <coughs> much more higher. Much higher compared to the, all the rest so far. Yes. Alright? Okay. Now, this is the third one, the fourth, fifth one. This is specifically a water device designed for water. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah. <coughs> okay. Now, what do you have to say about this? <coughs> this is the strongest. This is the strongest. Okay. Now, it is understandable because it is designed for that purpose. Now, the blower is designed to blow on people. But then again, by blowing onto the water, you do get the effects. Now, today we have tried for 30 seconds. But in future, we shall try a bit longer, maybe for one minute and see what happens as a comparison. So as a guideline, if you were to blow for more than 30 seconds, you do get the energy which is much stronger. So at least 30 seconds of blowing if you want to have the effects of terrorist energy in your water. I have done tests for 10 seconds, 20 seconds, 30 seconds. And uh, now I'm going to try for one minute and seek a comparison as to how strong the energy is in the water. Okay? Now, are you ready? Okay, now we have water which has been uh, charged by this blower for 1 minute, 60 seconds, alright? Okay, Okay, now we have already uh, used the blower, charged this water for 1 minute, exactly 60 seconds. Now again we have plain drinking water and we also have uh, water which has been charged for 3 minutes by a water device. Okay, now. We shall compare and uh, have a subjective test as to how they compare, right? Uh, Mr. Olivrin, can you please help me? Thank you. Now, once again, okay? Now, we are going to start with nothing. Okay, put your hand. Right, good. Ready? One, two, three. Now, this is the strength, okay? Did you hold as strong as possible? Yes. Very good. Now this is plain water. Once again. One, two, three. Relatively easy. Hold it very strong, huh? Okay. Good. Am I really that strong or? <laughs> Alright. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, good? Strong? Yes, yes good. Okay, 
this is three minutes charged by the water device. Ready? One, two, three. Strong. Okay. Thank you. Now, Mr. Pogolendren, when you compare these three, which is the easiest for you? I mean, I mean which uh, you found the, the least of the strength? Plain water. First one, plain water. The second one? Or are they the same? <coughs> this is much stronger. This is stronger than this? Yes. This one? Not this? This is a... Uh, okay, we shall try once more. Okay. Alright? Now hold as strong as you can. Just be sure. Okay? Ready? As strong as you can. Eh? Don't let go. One, two, three. Strong. <coughs> Strong. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> now, which do you think is stronger for you? That one. You feel this? Yes. Okay. Actually, I did feel the same way. Uh, and uh, I would say that it's as good as the other water. Huh? But probably a little bit stronger. Yeah. Would you agree with me? Do you agree with me? Yes, yes. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Bukulindri. Okay. So now you have it, uh, ladies and gentlemen. This is plain drinking water. Water charged for one minute by the eye telecare blower. Water charged for three minutes by a water device. Now again, this device is designed especially for the water. It's good. Here the blower is designed for other purposes but it is also doing the work of charging the water. Now if you must then I, I see that you can charge and drink this water. It will help you. Thank you. Okay, now this test we are going to compare uh, between uh, uh, three modalities. First one is plain drinking water. right? The second one is uh, water which has been charged uh, for one minute by the eye terror care blower. Now what we have done before this is, we have held it to the side. Now even with the water outside of the body, the energy is so strong that you can, uh, you, the reaction is there. Now what we will do is uh, for this time, we will also test if the water getting into the body and what uh, comes out of it. Right? So, Mr. Pugalindran, can you help me again? Now, before we start, Mr. Pugalindran, have you drank this water recently? No. How? Never drank? Okay, so <coughs> this is the first time you're going to drink. Yes. Okay, so I, that is important for me because we don't want somebody who has been drinking to be tested, so the results won't be, uh, won't be right. Okay, now. Now this is plain drinking water, water which you have been drinking uh, normally, alright? So are you ready? Come in front. <coughs> as strong as you can, alright? Don't let go. Very strong. One, two, three. Are you holding strong? Yes. Okay. Now this is water charged for one minute by the blower. And the water is outside. It's not even in him. Huh? Now ready? One, two, three. Is it strong? Yes. Is the difference big or small? Quite big. Okay. Quite now, this water is outside. Can okay, you drink this water? Drink only as much as you want. Okay. You don't have to finish it all. Is that enough? Okay. <laughs> we still have some more left. Okay, now, are you ready? Yes. <clears throat> uh, ladies and gentlemen, now we have seen water from outside. Now we are going to see what happens when, the wet water, when you drink that water. Okay? Now, ready? Yes. As strong as you can. One, two, three. <coughs> wow. You feel the difference? Yes. Now, this one, this one, and with the water inside. Which is stronger? The water inside. 
Now the water inside and water outside, how big is the difference? Quite big. Quite big, yes. alright? It is interval, there you have it. Now if I am, uh, maybe some of you might be thinking, is he doing the correct thing? Or is he just showing some magic show? So I recommend you try it out for yourself and you will know the difference. Now I am a water drinker, besides using the blower. I use a blower, I also charge and I drink the water. Alright? So I regularly drink. So now we shall try what happens to me. The last I drank this water was this morning. But uh, that wouldn't be enough. But what I'm trying to say is I'm regularly drinking. Alright? For the day, the normal days. But this morning because of uh, this, I couldn't drink enough. Anyway, come Mr. Pilgrim. We shall try, see what happens. Are you ready? Yes. <clears throat> okay, now. At the count of three, yeah? As strong as you can, huh? Keep it still. Ready? One, two, three. Come on, Mr. Pilgrim. Harder. As hard as you can. Stronger. Okay, now one more time. Five fingers. Okay, just straight, keep it straight. Ready? As hard as you can, huh? as strong as you can. One, two, three. Come on, push. Harder. Okay. Now, can you tell? <laughs> Were you doing it as best as you can? Or yes, that was my best. 100%? Yes. Yes. <clears throat> so, thank you, Mr. Gwendolyn. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not trying to show off or show that, uh, you know, I'm very strong. But what I'm trying to tell you is, because of the water, my body is constantly charged. I have the energy which comes from the water and my body, my cells are constantly hydrated. So this is what is giving me the strength. So I hope uh, this will be helpful to all of you. Keep yourself fully hydrated. Drink the water all the time. You will be hydrated and you will be fully charged. That I thank you.